What's up YouTube, Kyle here to bring you guys another video. I know it's been a while since I've made something or put something up. I've just been super busy and I kind of fell off, but uh, I do want to do a, basically a uh, review on face masks just because of the uh, issue that we're facing in the world right now. And uh, this is actually a face mask that I myself use quite a bit, even at work. I personally like to use it uh, a lot. <laughs> For like everyday use but I always um of course I wash it it's one of those uh, basically these masks that uh, you can actually wash and can keep for a while I usually wash it a lot like every like daily I mean so uh, this is actually the Luca face mask uh, this is actually made in Korea so I'm gonna go over the details on the packaging because uh, I don't know I'm not too versed on the exact uh, percentage of the uh, materials on this mask, but I know they are with made with polyester and polyurethane. So let's just go into that, yeah. Okay, so this is where the uh, packaging actually itself comes in. So as you can see, it's a Luca mask. I have two actually, just because I kind of like, I really like the design of the first one. So the first one, and I did technically, uh, want a second one just in case one is just like uh in like cleaning like i'm cleaning one and it's still drying and i kind of have to use it for work and have to go right away just because of the new bylaws especially in toronto and canada where you're supposed to have a face mask mandatory at all times in public spaces so you don't want to be like the basically that person that like risks older people or others because yeah that's not cool so like Luca face mask, this is slit, slit lime. Uh, there's barcode and then M is medium. So M, there's a hung layer because like I said, it's made in Korea. And I believe it's like Tesla and company, but I'm not too sure about like, it was actually Tesla on that one, but it does say Tesla here. So it's pretty cool. I actually just noticed that now looking at the packaging. Uh, second one I have here, it's a different type of barcode. like. So this is silver, sliver, prism, black L. This one does not have Tesla on it. So this was also, I believe it was a newer one or I don't know if the other one was a newer, but the slit lime is actually uh, more expensive because uh, it has like two uh, two layers, but yeah. Um, so obviously here we have L here so that uh, you can say as large, but Let's just go over the materials it has. So uh, let me just read this actually. So Luca is formulated from look A. Uh, we strive and seek for the best. The look we create is something new, unique and anonymous. Luca mask is where premium design meets fashion and protection to bring the ultimate urban accessory and fashion mask. So you can see 99.5% uh, UV protection, quick dry. Uh, what else? Let me see. So it's odor free. That's why I like it. Cause especially when you are wearing mask the same the same mask all the time, uh, if your breath is really bad, obviously it'll, like you can smell how awful it is. It's like actually really bad. So definitely wanted that. So like I them. So I wash a little mask. I'm trying to see if I can find the materials perfectly here so have to hand wash it cold in cold water not bleach do not machine dry or do not iron of course this is quality regulation fda approved silver powder to prevent the growth of microbiota with six secondary smells yes so like i said polyester polyurethane 88 percent 12 percent this is the uh, slit lime this one actually sold out i got these this one these masks from nrml.ca uh they they still have them on site uh, I also have like discount code because of like uh, honey or like yeah honey like buys me discount codes so shout out to them this is not uh, a sponsored video even though I would like to be sponsored by honey of course that'd be amazing but yeah moving on so let's just see if there's anything if it's similar so it does use okay this one is the silver one so 90% polyester 10% polyurethane uh, they're both different. I want to show you right away. But let me show you um, sizing. So sizing. Uh, these masks can also be found on Amazon.com, also in the UK. Uh, 
obviously if you're shipping to Canada, like you're gonna be paying the tax and it does get pretty pricey. The Canadian prices were pretty pricey, but I was like, it was only for my own health as well. It's like, it, definitely you cannot use this. This mask is not gonna protect you if you work in um, a healthcare setting. This is strictly for like going in public to like protect yourself from others, of course. Well, this is technically a fashion mask itself as in yes, but you can still technically use this to uh, keep yourself safe uh, from other public people because it is polyester. Uh, so polyester does keep uh, liquids away from you. So yes, it is good. And for these, I really like these because you can breathe, especially since now it's like super humid, it's like 32 degrees in Toronto, reaching to like 35. So this is like Filipino weather. So yeah. Uh, I can say that because I'm from the Philippines, so yeah, I know how hot it gets, and I usually don't like to be outside. But this is the sizing of the fit, so sorry, let's get this in focus. So small is for women, medium, you can fit women and men, large is for men. Uh, I'll show you sizing, but yeah, like when I first, I got first medium, uh, so. That was the only size left for the slit green one. So uh, that one, I felt like it was too small for my face. So I did order a large a second time, but the large was too big. And I'll show you how these masks look. Uh, first, I'll show you the, the slit green one. So this one is all, sorry for the lighting. Hopefully the lighting is here. But this is the slit green one. So black and lime green. Uh, this is why I wanted to get a second one because the material on this was coming off like it was starting to distress it's a pretty cool look but uh, <laughs> not for sustainability so yeah so as you can see it says Luca which is pretty cool so black and lime green is definitely one of like one of my favorite color combinations so it's definitely a cop I also got like uh, marketed by a cute Japanese girl so I was just like yeah I got marketed but like Still good product. I was really happy with it. Like materials were really good. I've been using it. It's like it's just been my go-to mask. Like I am gonna do more mask reviews because I bought a bunch. <laughs> just because. I don't know. It's just I don't know why I like face masks. It's because maybe I'm Asian, but so far, but yeah, if you guys like this video so far, like, comment, subscribe. We can share this content with more people. Uh and also likes will help for the YouTube algorithm so I can give this out more. But continue on. So this uh, black material is actually very light. So I purchased this like within March, April. Within March, April, I already had this mask because I was like, okay, I was already wearing a mask at work and I really didn't want to get the virus because my parents were really susceptible to it. Also my uh, brother as well, so. But yeah, couldn't really quit because I have to pay bills. You know what it is. So yeah, so for this look, Luca, it's black, lime green. This side is like cut off and that's what turned me off. It, it's definitely hype, but when it comes to purpose of protecting yourself, it was not very practical. Uh, the second dairy layer, the lime layer is actually a thicker, material so it's definitely a lot better as you can see it's not distressing like the black material here is like it's pretty cool but you know what i mean right it's not gonna protect you so it was based on reading that i was like oh it's a two layer mask and i was like cool uh, i want to protect myself right so did cop but obviously when I first got it, I was like, oh, I don't like this because the secondary layer on the black part was not like thick enough. But now it's just like, because it's humid, uh, I'm actually pretty happy with this product because like I have to wear a mask all the time wherever I go now. So uh, having a, a mask that's not too thick and like could stop myself from breathing like would like, I can still breathe decently well not as bad as like cloth it's also just this does not smell at all so definitely um the biggest like one of the biggest um benefits of purchasing this product so yeah 
I'll show you the other mask. This is the large. Okay, I have it wrong, but. <laughs> so as you can see, this is a, more of a black and silver. Uh, I tried to buy something that was more minimal because this is kind of like very high beast looking type of thing. Don't, I'm not hating on it. It's, it's really hype, but like I like it, but I wanted something more minimal for work. I could have caught the triple black one, but <laughs> I was just like, I wanted something to stand out. You know what I mean? It's just like, you want to buy something and still stand out. I was hoping this was just the black and the gray here, and then this would be the black, right? Just because you would assume that, but did not do that. And I was like, eh, but like, I still like it, right? This is the large. As you can see, we can compare this to the medium sized and side by side. I'll put these on my face, but like, as you can see, there's this is the medium sized one, and then, okay, sorry. And my phone is not overheating because it's humid. Life. <laughs> so, this is the silver itself, it comes out more, so it covers more of your face, but I'm gonna show you how it looks on my face in just a bit. Okay. Okay, so this is the medium size, the uh, slight gray, sorry. Uh, <laughs> I promise I don't have this virus, but yeah, I'm like about to sneeze and I don't want to see since this video, but like, this is how the mask look itself looks like, medium size. It's covering my face uh, pretty well. Like I can definitely breathe <laughs> in it, especially if, but if I'm in public, I just raise it up so that nothing goes into like my nostrils and whatnot. It's definitely a hype look. For sure, I definitely like it. As you can see, that's why I didn't really like it as much because it doesn't fully cover like my other side, the bottom part of my like face. But yeah, this is how it looks. I'm trying not to sneeze. Uh, so <laughs> just for like uh, purposes, for show purposes, you can do sorry. It's like this. Hopefully, it did not rip that. <laughs> I don't know if you can do it like that. Actually, maybe. I've never tried that, actually. This look, doing it like this on one side. Just, I don't know if you really want it to be like degen. It's not degen, but I'm, you know what I mean. <laughs> yeah, so. You can see my lips, so. And that's this mask, and I want to show the uh, the large mask. Yeah, so this is itself the large mask, right? You can see as it, on my face, it covers up more. I can just pull this up more. Just to cover my face. There's no tightener on this. I have another mask that you can tighten, actually. So, I have quite the big head, so I need the large. So, this will cover up. It's also pretty stylish. Uh, the silver, I'm pretty sure, reflects in the sun <laughs> or light when it hits it. So it's like if you're really hype, if you're really into that hype look, for sure. So this one only has the one, uh, basically, uh, cover. This part here is really soft and <laughs> it's really smooth compared to this part, which is more of a fabric. This part is just. It's just there for style, honestly. Yeah. But so far, it's pretty cool. I'm gonna do more mask uh, reviews now. <laughs> and probably like next week or, or so. But yeah, like I said, comment, rate, subscribe, share this video so I can get more out there. Also, uh, Bam Bam more, like a GOT7 Bam Bam more. Got seven bam bam more one of these masks, the black and white one. Uh that one insta sold out just because especially when they found out right. So but yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace.